Tell me who you are and why are you here? Uh, I'm 56 from the U.S. US uh, from North Carolina originally. So I live in Hawaii now. So flew all the way from Hawaii here. So the question as far as why I'm here, to me, you know, a lot of the other conflicts are gray, but this conflict is definitely black and white. This is about good versus evil. This is a storybook, you know, any movie we've ever watched, this is definitely evil against good. I mean, we're battling a situation here where, you know, the U Ukrainians and the rest of the world are caring and kind and, and generous and, and unselfish and, and take care of one another. And it's just a matter of, you know, we need to stand up for that. That is the most important thing in the world is just to show human beings that we're kind and we're caring and that we take care of one another and that the world is united so that we feed each other and make sure that, you know, we, we all move forward as, as one collective whole unit. So, you know, we feel the pain of, of one country's failure and their conflicts and we enjoy the successes of, of other countries that are doing good and, and we all work together and for some reason, Russia does not grasp this concept that we're we're all one unit, and we have to get along and work together and 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 be normal human beings. This is 2022. We have to work together. It's it's it seems asinine that we have a, a leader in a country that does not understand the concept of of being unselfish and being generous and being kind and just the basic moral values that, that are required by human beings these days. It blows my mind.